The LA6450 is a 6 watt 450 nanometer laser. The LA5808 is a 5 watt 808 nanometer laser. These are useful for engraving, cutting, and burning the solder mask off of traces. You can cut, engrave, and etch in foam, paper, acrylic, and metals. You can also burn off the solder mask on the circuit board to do a chemical etch later on. Alright, I'm going to tell you a little bit about our low-powered lasers. We have two of them. We have, this is a 6-watt laser at 450 nanometers. It's a blue light. It's good for cutting most things. We also have a 5-watt laser at 808 nanometers, which is red light. And that's good for dark materials, but it, it'll bounce right off of white paper and stuff. This one here, the 450 nanometer, we actually use for engraving serial numbers on some of our parts. Uh, focal distance is about 4 inches or 5 inches below the laser. Just like any other Hyrel 3D head, these slots, these gibs go in the slots on the yoke. This is the connector where the power and signal comes up. You shouldn't have to use them, but these are the 2.5 millimeter driver uh, screws for adjusting. Your firmware would be flashed if there's a new version of firmware through this programming port here. Across your ST link, your connectors, and this is an output. This reads how many volts and how many amps of current is currently being drawn for the laser. On your laser, we have the same LEDs, the same circuit board as all of our print head type accessories. So this would be your heartbeat, your CAN bus transmit and receive, an error light. Uh, there's no heater on this, there's no fan power, and I believe the motor lights will indicate when the laser is actually running. This is a class 4 laser, and we use this for cutting foam, for engraving serial numbers, and I'll get you a couple of parts. So with this laser here, we do stuff like engraving serial numbers on some of our print heads that you can see here. And we also engrave some legends in some of our objects. Uh, this plate was actually done with a spindle tool head on a two-part laminate. And we also use this laser for cutting the uh, packing foam custom, custom for the heads that we ship and the parts that we ship. So you can adjust the intensity either with a duty cycle adjustment or just by printing faster or slower to get more or less penetration or time on target. You can use the laser to burn off the solder mask for a later chemical etching. You can do this both for isolation traces and for mounting pads for simple circuit boards. This is the uh, LA6450 and the red one is the LA5808. For more information, see highrail3d.com or highrail3d.net.